Genius Research often tries to have an impact beyond the walls of academia. So it isn't about the ivory towers and knowledge for knowledge sake, it's about trying to um, affect social policy, it's about trying to change um, governmental attitude and legislation, it's about trying to make a difference to the way that people live their lives. So for example, some recent research we've done from an enduring love study about how couples sustain their long-term partnerships has been working with a charity sector, especially Brooke, to develop resources for young people about relationships and sex education. It's been working with practitioners to think about are some of the research tools that we use useful for that um, clinical practice and how might we extend them and think about how our research findings can help that relationship guidance and relationship support sector improve their clinical practice. And in this sense, what we're doing is also then trying to reach a far wider audience about the general population. So getting the general population to hear about our research and to reflect upon their own relationships. So in this sense, and many others, this is how we bring the, the macro and the micro together. How people experience their personal lives, for example, in couple relationships, and how those ideas of the couple norm and coupledom, for example, are given privilege through social policy, through legislation, and through the cultural attitudes around what makes a family, what makes um, couples experience themselves as legitimate.